Midwinter in northern Italy may sparkle beautifully, but best of all, the frosty weather offers an excuse for friends and family to gather by the fire. And what better to enjoy good company over a meal? Yet this is no ordinary Italian meal in an ordinary Italian household. Tessa Kiros was born in London to a Greek Cypriot father and a Finnish mother. She grew up in Africa. A truly international spirit, happy in several languages. <laughs> Tessa's husband, Giovanni, and their two daughters were born in Italy, but their cousins have a French father and they live in Athens. Did you peel the apples? So it's no surprise that Tessa's award-winning cookbook, Falling Cloudberries, describes itself as a world of family recipes. It features meals from half a dozen countries, each one of them with a strong personal connection to a branch of Tessa's extraordinary family tree. She's translating for the two Nordic. Families, grandmothers, uh, people cooking from their hearts in different places of the world. I respond to that far more than I would just to a, an elegant, senseless, soulless meal that I would have to pay a lot of money for. That's for a, a grandmother portion. Whether it's breakfast, lunch, dinner, or a more important festival, food is one of the main accessories, I'd say. Something that brings and weaves places, people, time together. When Tessa cooks a family meal, all the family can get involved. Her Italian husband. Her sister over from Athens. her mother from Finland and her Italian mother-in-law. The heart of this midwinter meal is Tuscan mixed roast, a speciality of Tessa's Italian mother-in-law. Most of the Italian things I've learned from Vilma and Mario. Her husband is a chef. So we're talking about... Vilma's a fantastic cook. She's been an amazing inspiration for me. We've got Italian sausages, um, pork, questo è capocollo, this is the shoulder of pork, and uh, sausages cut up into pieces, si mette il pane, in fondo solo. And we're going to put a cube of bread in them, and they need to be cooked with rosemary and sage, and all the herbs that we've collected. Directly from the hills of The Greece. family's international traditions are represented by Greek-inspired salads and roast vegetables. Close up over here because you might roast. The cardamom buns for dessert are a Finnish tradition, courtesy of Sippi, Tessa's mother. I remember a lot of the things that I do now for my children. I remember it from my childhood. You know, like the cinnamon buns, it makes me remember Finland and my childhood and my mother. I can't eat them without thinking about all these things. Family, that's the key word in Tessa's world of food. Family and fun.